Today, I'm gonna talk about Micro Micro Crime City, the game from Zohan Singh and published by Pegasus Spiel. This is a very easy game to learn and to play. The style of this game is almost the same as Where's Waldo game. But unlike Where's Waldo, in this game, you are going to be a detective and you are going to solve 16 different cases in the city. And of course, you will need the magnifying glass because there will be a lot of components, a lot of drawings in this game which will be hard for you to look for. The 16 different cases will be in 16 different envelopes like this. On the cases, we'll always start with the white card. And of course, beside the name, it will also have the number of stars indicated the difficulty level. So let's talk about some of the cases right here. So over here, we have a case called Dead from Above. The front of the card will be the name of the case and a difficulty level indicated by the number of stars. The back of the card will tell me more about the story in detail. This information are very useful because it will help you to solve the case. Now let's talk about the second card. The second card right here is the first mission or the first task that the detectives have to solve. In order to know the answer, you have to look in the back and over here, right here, this little corner is the answer of the task that you're looking for and it also has the story behind the task. After you finish up this one, you keep going with the next task. So the next task will be, was it an accident? And you have to solve the same thing. And you will keep going until you solve all the seven cards. The seven is a number right here. And that's it. That's how you solve one of the case in Micro Micro Crime City. As I said, this is like where's Waldo. Basically in the game, you just look into this map right here, find the details, find the corner, and then give the lead investigator the hint or the location where it happened. And if your answers match the result, then of course you solve the hint and you go on to the next hint until all the hints are solved then you solve the case. This is a very well made map because it is not easy to tear this map apart and it's also very easy to fold it like this. All about the cards, they are all, all in the envelopes and these envelopes are made with very durable components as well. The card itself is not easy to bend and they serve the purpose well. This is a very easy to learn game and of course it can be played with many people. So they recommend to play from 2 to 4 but often time I play with like 8 people and it still works well. The more the merrier. The more you have the people look for the hint or for the solution, the funnier it is. What I don't like about this game is some of the case can be very gruesome. Like some of the case might involve drug, love, addictions or even killer so be kind of cautious when you play with kid the game itself say that yes you need to play with a kid till eight years old or older which is fine I guess but this is another component of the game which is a magnifying glass it helps to find the solution much easier and that's it for today that's it for Micro Macro Cram City, the best game of the year in 2021. Hope you will like it. See you next time.